Last time we arrived in the beautiful Bancroft Basin, in the heart of historic Stratford-upon-Avon. The birthplace of William Shakespeare and home to the Royal Shakespeare Company. We had a mooring right next to our famous neighbour. Join us as we explore this wonderful town and then start our journey down the beautiful River Avon. It's an exciting day because Chris from Three Element has just arrived with our new cushions. Pop's making friends of course. You excited Pete? I am excited. I'm very excited. Do you approve of the new cushions? They're good aren't they because we can just wipe them clean. Don't be making a mess on them okay? Thank you, bye-bye. Bye. We've got visitors again today. Alex and Hannah have come to Stratford for the day with us and we're just moving from the basin here just across there through the lock and out onto the river. We're in book two of the Nicholson's guides. These are the map books we use to navigate while we're cruising. And here's our very short journey from Bancroft Basin through the lock out onto the River Avon. The trip boat's just left, so they're in the lock at the moment, and Alex and I, ready with the windlasses, Alex, <laughs> are going to go and set the lock. Safe travels, Hannah. That's a trip boat. The uh, locker's just emptied and they're just opening those bottom gates and then Alex and I will fill it up again. Our annual Canal and River Trust licence covers mooring in the Bancroft Basin, but moving out onto the River Avon you need to purchase a licence. It's easy to do this on the Avon Navigation Trust website. We bought the short term licence valid for 14 days on the river, but you can see there's quite a few different options, depending on how much time you want to spend cruising. There's lots of useful information on the website, such as the River Watch page, where you can click on each of the locks and get up-to-date information about the weather and flood levels. You can also sign up for notices and alerts, so you can be kept up-to-date on anything that may impact your journey. today.
Pete's just turning around so that we get the better view of the uh, Royal Shakespeare Company out of the hatch by the dining table. It's so wide on the river that we can just turn wherever we want. I was bought one of these treasure trails as a gift when we were on holiday in Cornwall and we had such good fun exploring with it so I bought the treasure trail for Stratford-upon-Avon. It takes you off the beaten track and makes you look in detail at everything around you. And there was in Shakespeare's day and many more tourists so stay alert and together the film crew are relying on you to save them from more mishaps. Who made all the figure, figures save so that of Hamlet, Hamlet yes. which was entrusted to. Uh, so he didn't make Hamlet. Marley. So all of these things were made by him apart from Hamlet. It's so sad. What's the Hamlet quote, Alex? To be or not to be? That is the question. Cue number four. Cross the way. Cross the way. Across the way. Don't get that on YouTube. Promise I know how to read. Across the way from the next image, spot a rabbit specialist and learn what sort of tails these rabbits might have. Why are you speaking in your posh voice? The letters in this word. What kind of tails do they have? Oh, okay. There is an eye there. As you like it. And AIA is Hamlet. Work out what FAI is. Work out what FAI is. Twelfth Night. Twelfth Night's Bridge. Off. Boom.
section match the last three letters of a location C -U -S. on the map to eliminate. C U S. C U S. There. Yeah. That's the one. Good job. Good job. It's actually not part of the quest. I just wanted to look at the trees. to see a square of letters that have been replaced within those letters spot a number. Sorry, there you go. Oh, There's nothing more English than okay. ice cream sure. in the rain. Yeah. In the rain. Thank you. Thank you, honey. Thank you. Thank you. And that evening we enjoyed As You Like It, outdoors in the Garden Theatre at the Royal Shakespeare Company. Risotto by special request. Yeah. My so request. Excited. Oh wow! What what have you seen from that one? We are very very lucky. So they are Montreal steak seasoning, which we get from the states. Um, and I've got a oh UK gosh. steak seasoning. Whoa! Hey. Peppery flavour to it. And check that out. Ooh. Ooh yeah! Ooh yeah! Very, very nice. That looks so. The presentation. It's a bit ten out of ten. Yeah, I'd right? say ten out of ten for the presentation. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Who wants some steak? No, sir. No steak for you. I like the lemon zest on this. Actually. Nice. Yeah. Ready? Three, two, one.
and after a beautiful few days in Stratford, it was time to continue our journey down the River Avon. Ready Pop? Just a short cruise today. Just doing a U-turn to head towards the next lock. We're just going to Shakespeare Marina today, which will only take us 20 minutes perhaps, depending on how quick the lock is. We left our mooring opposite the Royal Shakespeare Company Theatre, through one lock to Shakespeare Marina, to leave our boat for a couple of days while we visited friends and family. Windy this morning. The lock is reinforced by a series of rectangular steel girder frames to overcome the high ground pressures. I'm going to push on these to close the gates. Another now, but so we can share the lock with us. That's a good timing. It's quite heavy, aren't they? Binding.
heading out of Shakespeare Marina back onto the River Avon but we don't really know where we're going to stop <laughs> for a change, for a change. <laughs> we'll just go a bit see if we can find well it depends what the mooring arrangements are like we think there I think there are 48 hour moorings on most of the locks we think so we'll just see how far we go whether we get to Bigford on Avon or maybe stop before then I don't know we shall see there's a seagull on that post there we're a long way from the sea aren't we? I think he's lost perhaps he's lost episodes we'll be sharing our adventures as we cruise on the River Avon and the River Severn and almost out to sea. We leave Stratford-upon-Avon and head south on the River Avon, stopping to explore Bidford, Evesham and Pershaw and heading on to the River Severn at Tewkesbury, then the magnificent Gloucester docks and on to the Gloucester and Sharpness Canal to the very end at Sharpness where the views across the Severn Estuary are absolutely stunning. Then we retrace our route back up the Gloucester and Sharpness Canal with another couple of days in Gloucester, then continuing on the River Severn to Tewkesbury, Worcester and up to Stourport, where we join the Staffordshire and Worcestershire Canal. Thank you so much to everybody that supports our channel through Buy Me A Coffee and YouTube Super Thanks. And as always, thank you to all of our viewers. If you've enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up and give us a like. And leave us a comment and tell us what you thought. I saw you